Shirley, the country will observe Veterans Day next Tuesday on November 11th, but celebrating their contributions isn't limited to just that one day. And that's why we've come to American International College this morning, where there is a terrific exhibit that everyone is invited to come and see. Joining us this morning, first is John Short, who's the Executive Director of Development and Alumni Relations here at the college, and also Alvin Page, who is the curator of the exhibit that you will see here today. Gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us. Joining us this morning. Um, Alvin, could I start with you, please? Tell yes, everyone what we are in the midst of because it is a wonderful exhibit. This exhibit uh, basically covers uh, the military memorabilia, including uniforms, weapons, and some other uh, uh, photographs outside of it. Uh, this exhibit is really the covers the faction, the allies from the uh, the uh, our opponents, the Japanese, the Nazis, and the allies from the European theater, and of course the American military, which includes the Army, Navy, Air Force, men and, w and women. And we should also note that the uniforms that you're looking at right now range from those that were worn in the Revolutionary War right up through the Korean conflict, right? Yes, it is. Okay. John, tell us what else people will find when they come down to the college today. Well, today we have a ceremony uh, honoring uh, our veterans at 11 o'clock this morning on the quad. We will have another ceremony on the Veterans Day itself. Uh, but we also have a USO show uh, taking place this afternoon from 3 to 5, a, a USO canteen show, 14 band members, other Andrews sisters, other acts. And uh, people are invited to come down for that. Uh, it's a $10 charge, but uh, tickets are still available. And we would love to have people come down. And the exhibit itself is going to be open for two weeks. Uh, and that's from 10 to 4 weekdays and uh, weekends by arrangement. And we would love to have as many people in the community come down and see this wonderful exhibit that is the display or the collection of one of our alumni. Okay. Thank you very much, both of you, for joining us this morning. Again, things get underway here at 11 o'clock, a little later on, and there's going to be a flyover as well at that time. So come on down at American International College, live in Springfield, Myrna Maloney, 22 News.